Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. This is the Wix online meeting number 114. Getting close to Halloween for those of you that do that kind of thing. You know, kids are not, and if you don't, I suppose you have to get ready for the kids. Uh, as always, these meetings are recorded for those of us, those, not of us, those others who are unable to attend in person with us right here. It's going to be a long day. I skipped last week. Bob and Sean did a great job. Um, I'm still kind of recovering from back-to-back -back trips. So we're going to have a short agenda today. We'll do triage just to catch up. We'll do any questions, comments, things people want to talk about. Um, and then we'll probably call this a short meeting. Because honestly, there aren't that many bugs unless people have things they would, they would like to talk about. So moving on. Triage. Bob, you ready? I'm ready. All right. Four, five, five. One, two, three, four, five. Hey, I have a mouse cursor. I shouldn't say anything. All right, here we go. Oh, this is still hanging out here with no answers. So what are we thinking? Well, we got the uh, the project, which I think was the first thing we were looking for. It's, you know, it looks fairly normal, except I've never seen what I'm guessing is like the entire set of payloads included as content. I haven't either, but... Um, so that being somewhat unusual, I asked for the whole, what happens if you take that out? I can, you know, I, I can't imagine why it would, you know, cause a problem, but right. I can also imagine it causing a problem because, <laughs> well, you know, I don't know. Some hard-coded static array? I don't know. So are we holding on to this for one more week, or are we making this, or one more session, two weeks? Yeah, yeah let's, let's, let's see one more time. All right. Oh, and I lost the mouse cursor, see? Yeah, I actually noted that it went away as soon as Bob started talking, so I'm wondering if... No, I clearly my fault. Uh, someone, please... We're having people delete the templates now. Like, this is turning into a thing. Um, I'm starting to close bugs. Not a bug if they delete the whole template, so... Yep. Like, not a bug. Start over again. Um, all right, so Sean, you said in the end that we may need to work, revert the workaround. Um, oh, it didn't. F I see. So the workaround you did didn't work anyway um, later on. Well, so Sean, I saw that and I was a little bit confused. Okay, I was a lot confused. Um, the so the workaround was the switch to shell execute, and that did work for Windows 10 like RTM, right? Right. But it has since stopped working in later builds. Yeah. It's really weird. Yeah, that is really weird. Um, damn. All right. Well, the good news is Windows 10, we have to worry a lot less about people being stuck on old versions. Even businesses are kind of pushed to keep up to date. So this bug is about reverting the change? Yeah, because like this bug happened even with normal execution. Oh. So it was just a normal custom action. Got it. And 4857 was, you had to go into the new apps and features. Right. Yeah, all right. Sounds like we should um, fix that. Custom actions with some win forms. That sounds like trouble, though. Mm hmm I wonder if deep down this is the same sort of thing that we're having problems with burn, where like they've started adding some uh, set DLL directory to remove vulnerabilities and it's creating problems. So, all right. So I guess we'll take this in 311 because that's where it's hitting. Yes. Yeah. That's fine. Wix shell exec to allow custom parameters. Are one or more parameters to be passed to into the execution in order to launch that? Wix shell exec does not support passive parameters to an executable where necessary. OK. So Wix4, this guy could implement it there, right? 
Yeah, I suppose. I mean, all right. So, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay. Fine. Future request was for. Tell him he could implement it if he wants it. Uh, Burn should support side loading of Apex packages. Yeah, we've talked about this in the past, and it was a lot less interesting in previous versions of Windows before Windows 10 because side loading was <laughs> near impossible. Um, and now it is much more straightforward. So, yeah, probably could look at this. Yeah, Jacob's right about that last bug. Uh, yep. So, yeah, Wix 4? Sure. Yeah. Strings are no longer formatted. This is interesting. Um, they're actually showing it in our UI, which is kind of nice. Um, and it worked on one build of Windows, then not another build of Windows, and so hopefully it's just a bug they're fixing somewhere. Although I really don't know how they break this, but yeah. Yeah, I was a little curious about that myself. Also curious that they would actually be touching Windows Installer. Yeah, that's why I'm wondering what happened there. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. That's cute. Not under our control. But anyway, it looks like this has gone away. So I guess we resolve it external and we'll call it good. Yep. All right. I promise this will be a short meeting because I knew there weren't that many bugs. Um, just kind of trying to dig out of everything that's going on. Anybody else have things they want to talk about here now? Things going on? I know it's been quiet the last uh, month or two. That's because I've been <laughs> actually got flying the last little bit, so it really messes up my productivity in anything else. Um, Jacob or John's writing something. Uh, just need to get through October, November at this point. I'm pretty sure the bog is okay with it. <laughs> So what are we going to do with an XSD for Wix Proj? Like, like actually install an XSD that, oh, I see, install, install an XSD and it's somehow associated with MS Build? Yep. Yep, it turns out that there already is an XSD for um, common targets. Um, okay. And because everything, it, it's actually kind of interesting. Everything in MS Build is, you know, basically an element. So XSD actually works, and IntelliSense actually works. If you're editing the project, you know, if you unload the project and then open it. But how do you target an XSD to just a Wix proj and not like a CS proj and things like that? Um, I think it's magic. Okay. Well, then I'll be curious to see what John does, because that'll be a... Sure. It, it, it's... It was something, it actually brought it up um, as part of that uh, the blog post uh, from the .NET folk who, uh, you know, are talking about the switch from Project JSON to, to CS Pride, back to MS Build. Yep. Yep. And that was one of the, you know, one of the things, yes, there will be, you know, IntelliSense for these things. All right. Cool. And it turns out it's already there, so. All right. Well, sounds reasonable. Uh, anything else? Sounds great, John. Take it. It's all yours. Anything else people want to talk about? I'm totally good with a 15, maybe closer to 10-minute meeting since we got a little start, a little late start. I wish there was a clicker that said how long we've been doing this. Oh, there's 13 minutes. Okay. There's a timer. All right, we can sit here in silence for another minute and a half to get an even 15 minutes, or we can call it a meeting. Uh, any preferences, which way to go? It looks like Sean just dropped out and will drop in, so we're going to drop him up here. So, anything else? I think right. you should entertain us for another minute and a half. I almost did. I know. I mean, I'm now realizing it's only been 20 seconds, so no, we're not doing that. All right, cool. On that note, with lack of entertainment, uh, <laughs> complete lack of entertainment, short meeting this week, got through all the bugs, verified them, kicked them back out, put them in the right places, yay, um, and we'll pick up again in 
two weeks, which will still be very busy on this side. Um, the beginning of November is particularly gnarly for me with anniversary, kids, wife's birthdays, all like packed at the beginning, plus the MVP summit if I'm going to go to that. But it's always at the same time of everything else, which makes that first week in November just crazy. It's an election um, day. Um, yeah, but that's all absentee here, so it's pretty sure. Yeah, well, Washington is special. Yeah, I don't know why other people don't do it because it's pretty nice. Um, it is. That's it. All right. All right. All right. Uh, I'm not going to make another 30 seconds. So, anyway, you guys have a wonderful afternoon, evening, whenever you're watching this, whatever time you might be catching up with the Wix online meeting. Uh, two weeks from now, we'll see you again. Bye. Bye. Bye.